In the war on terror, the U.S. increasingly uses drones to target terrorists, particularly in Afghanistan, Libya, Pakistan, Somalia, and Yemen. However, the effectiveness of drone strikes is highly debated. On one hand, drone strikes may weaken terrorist organizations by killing key terrorist leaders and destroying their communication networks. On the other hand, drone strikes may cause blowback from the local population, perhaps because of the collateral damage they cause or the violation of state sovereignty. So the local people may actually turn against the U.S. and even side with the terrorists. This naturally leads us to ask, do drone strikes curb terrorism or encourage terrorism? But finding an answer to this question has been difficult. We can count the number of drone strikes, the number of subsequent terror attacks, and even quantify anti-US hatred, anti-US protests, and radicalization. But it is hard to test whether drone strikes cause changes in patterns of terrorism and attitudes in the targeted country because several other factors are also changing at the same time. We employ an instrumental variable approach to solve that empirical problem by looking at days when drones cannot strike because of reasons that are completely unrelated to terror attacks and the fight against terror. Specifically, if there is a lot of wind, drones are less likely to fly and hit their targets. We then test if terror attacks and anti-US sentiment as well as radicalization in the local population change after days when drones do not strike because of strong winds. Analyzing data from Pakistan, we find that drone strikes increase terrorism. On average, one US drone strike results in four additional terror attacks in the next week. This means drone strikes are responsible for up to 17.5% of all terror attacks in Pakistan, amounting to a loss of 6,000 lives between 2006 and 2016. To identify anti-US sentiment and radicalization, we then study the leading Pakistani newspaper, Google Trends, and anti-US protests. We find that drone strikes increase anti-US sentiment and radicalization in Pakistan. So, US drone strikes seem counterproductive. They actually increase terrorism. We hope this research informs policymakers and those interested in learning more about what drone strikes actually do.